So you have a dash cam, 1080p, full HD, night vision, yada, yada, yada. But when you need the footage the most, you can't see the license plate properly or any other crucial details. Is 1080p full HD the reason why your footage is blurry? Would your dash cam capture more details if say it was 2K or 4K? Today we're going to put four dash cams to the test. All these dash cams are flagship models of these brands, so we assume they are the best that they have to offer. We will also show you different settings and accessories and customizations that you can provide with these cameras to make sure they have the best license plate readability. The Viofo A139. One of the latest 2K QHD dash cams from Viofo, it comes in both a 2 channel and a 3 channel system. Either way, it offers 2K 1440p front and 1080p full HD rear video recording. The Blackview DR900X Plus. The latest 4K UHD dash cam from Blackview, and it's without a doubt Blackview's best dash cam to date in terms of video quality. It offers 4K front plus 1080p full HD rear video recording. The Thinkware U1000. The highest resolution dual channel system on the market, a 4K UHD front and 2K QHD rear setup. The Nextbase 622GW. While a relatively new name on the Black Box My Car website, Nextbase is the best selling dash cam brand in the UK. The 622GW records at 4K UHD. We're going to put these four dash cams in three rounds of testing. Our first test is license plate readability with default settings. Our second test is license plate readability in most optimized settings. And finally, our third test is testing the field of view and visibility of the camera. Disclaimer, the purpose of the tests is not to compare and contrast, but rather to help you determine the best settings and accessories to get the most out of your dash cam's recording capabilities so that more details are captured. Because you never know when you'll need them. Test 1. License Plate Readability and Default Settings Test 2. License Plate Readability in the Most Optimized Settings Test 3. The Field of View and the Visibility Test Here are some factors that help determine how well the dash cam can capture footage, such as license plates. Recording resolution, which refers to the number of pixels in a frame. 
A higher pixel count gets you an image with better quality. 2. Frame rate, which refers to the amount of frames taken per second of whatever the camera is capturing. The higher the frame rate is, the more frames there are of that moment, thus allowing the footage to be more clear with fast moving objects. 3. Image stabilization, which reduces the shakiness in your footage, allowing the most clear captured footage of some bumpy situations. 4. Night vision, which is a term used to describe the dash cam's recording capabilities under low light conditions. Dash cams with proper night vision technology typically adjust exposure automatically with changing light environments so that more details can be recorded. 5. CPL filters. In sunny and bright driving conditions, lens flares and overexposed footage from the dash cam can compromise the ability to capture a license plate clearly. Having a CPL filter can reduce these risks. High bitrate may improve the quality and smoothness of the video, especially when recording fast motion or high contrast scenes. But keep in mind that higher bitrate videos take up more space on the micro SD card. Most dash cams have a menu setting where you can change the exposure value. By default, this is usually set to zero. But if you do most of your driving at nighttime, you can use the setting to improve the quality of your footage. If you have a dark tinted window, you may also use the setting to adjust the brightness if the footage is appearing too dark. License plate design. License plates in North America often use this very thin font that is not picked up as easily by video cameras. At night, this effect is very clear when your own vehicle's headlights are reflecting off the plates in front of you. This might not be very obvious to the human eye, but in fact, it makes reading license plates very difficult for dash cams. It's still important to have a dash cam, however, because in the event of an accident, you can still find out which cars hit you, the traveling speed and the distance, and all the other important details you need. And once you're pulled over with the other driver, you can still capture their license plates while both cars are parked. Another tip we like to recommend is reading the license plate out loud, in case your dash cam footage doesn't really capture it that well. So that way at least the dash cam can record the audio of you saying it. License plate is A, B, C, 1, 2, 3. We hope this video gave you a better insight on different dash cams, accessories, and optimization settings you can use for your ideal driving, whether it's daytime driving or nighttime driving. Thanks for watching this video and we hope you found it helpful. Don't forget to leave us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more Black Box My Car.